Hey guys, it's Christina with Christina's 200. So I did a little bit of recording earlier and let me go ahead and put that in right here. I legit, I scraped the window. I kid you not, it is literally only two hours from the time I went to work earlier and you could completely see out of the window. And it's not even, look, it's not even snowing. Okay, so I have scraped my windshield. I am ready to go. And I'm gonna go to the grocery store, get a few goodies. Somehow I haven't eaten today and I'm not in the stage where I wanna do um, intermittent fasting yet. I just wanna eat when I'm hungry. Haven't really been hungry today. I had to come here to work for a couple hours to meet a couple customers. But uh, I'm hungry now. So I'm gonna go to the grocery store because I don't really have a whole lot keto friendly food. Just, you know, cakes and sandwich stuff. So we're gonna go get some good keto food. And I'm gonna be stuck. We're doing a figure skating show and for the first time, I'm not responsible for anything. I'm just going to help my cousin who um, has started a business like mine and she's in charge. So I just get to go and be a worker bee, but I need to make sure that I am prepared with keto friendly foods. <sighs> it's gonna be tough because usually after things like, and they already said that we're gonna meet and go to breakfast and then after we're going to go for dinner and normally I like to go to buffets so I think I'm going to make sure I fill my stuff so that I keep it keto because it's possible it is possible to eat keto even in situations like that so there's the challenge all right bye guys Alright guys, I just left the grocery store. This is my keto haul. This is kind of my back to basics keto food. Um, I am spoiled. Sometimes I'll get ribeyes, but they have the chucks on sale. Got these two big steaks for $14.67. So I've got plenty of steaks for dinner. I've got hamburger meat for lunches. I've got sausage. I'm more of a sausage than a bacon person. For breakfast, plenty of eggs. I plan on hard boiling a few of them for snacks for tomorrow. Avocado, I think this one will be about ready. We'll see. Um, I know, not perfect keto, but hey, I'm a little lazy and convenience is, I'm busy, sorry, I'll say busy. <laughs> um, Convenience is good. So I have some cheese. These are lifesaver when I get snacky. Um, you can't really eat a whole bunch of them because you tire out, but you get that munching effect where you're eating and able to um, actually eat something. You just have to be balanced, but at the same time, it is a good snack. My Mio, I am not doing anything other than Soleil uh, Keterade. Um, and Mia water. So I also have pink Himalayan and I got a little empty bottle to make my Soleil water. This is day three and I haven't even made Soleil water. So before I start crying because of keto flu, that's what I'm getting. I really think this is a nice um, base for beginner keto. Anyway, here is my dinner. It is half of one of those steaks. I actually didn't weigh it. And some mozzarella on top and half of an avocado. So excited to eat this. Okay, so I have such a busy day tomorrow. And so I know that I will not have time to, um, I got the grays. I will not have any time to record. I'm going to be um, doing a figure skating show. My cousin is taking over figure skating shows for me. Uh, we make shirts and other stuff for them, but I'm going to go along and help. And so, yeah, I have to make sure that I eat right tomorrow. I'll probably record some tomorrow, but I wanted to get a video out before 
tomorrow so that I'm staying on it, guys, staying on it. Um, anyway, it's funny that my hair was giving me problems. Do you know it is down? It is all brushed out. My hair is super long, so I'll tell you, most of the month of December, it was in a bun. So the, getting back in keto also means... Um, just kind of doing stuff for yourself, doing stuff for me, making yourself feel better and brushing my hair out. Not that it was just awful, but wearing it down, um, is just a big step for me. So usually when I have my hair down and I have a little bit of makeup on, I feel so much better about myself. Anyway, I've got my jug of Keterade here and i am going to watch a few more videos i'm finding some really nice youtubers i'm really excited um we're gonna make this work guys anyway i'm gonna do that and go to bed and i will talk to you guys tomorrow bye